finished look. Um, it's inspired by autumn and fall and the leaves and the trees changing. Um, I did put a lot of thought into this. So I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. And if you want to learn how to do this look, just keep watching. Okay guys, so this is my bare eyes. I do have foundation on right now. Um, but I'm gonna prime my eyes with Urban Decay's Primer Potion. You guys know I love this. Um, I'm just spreading that all over my lids to help my eyeshadows last longer and look a bit more vibrant than they would without it. Okay, so I'm taking this kind of neutral, shimmery, golden shadow. I got this at an ice in like an icing palette. Um, icing is a store, and I'm taking my Victoria's Secret flat shader brush. You, you guys see all, this all the time. I'm sorry, it's kind of discontinued, but I'm just swiping that all over my lid. Um, it's a really, really pretty color, and this look is all about layering. Um, I did put some thought into it, and I'm like, okay, so if I layer this and I layer this and I layer this, it's gonna like represent the whole tree and things. So yeah. Okay, now I'm taking uh, Toasted from my Naked palette and just swiping this on top of the icing shadow. Those don't, those unfortunately don't have names. It really annoys me when they don't. But this is gonna kind of symbolize the like deeper redder tones. And now I'm taking Buck from my Naked palette. I pointed at Sidecar, I meant Buck, but I'm taking this into the crease to kind of make the transition from the redder, from the red and golds to the little bit of green that I'm gonna put into my crease. And um, now I'm taking this really gorgeous green color. I love this color. I um, just adore it. And it's from the same icing palette. And just taking that into my crease over where I put, put Buck. I don't really, I think this really reminds me of like evergreen trees and Christmas time. But it like ties this whole look together and makes it look very fall. Otherwise, it would just be a really like a brown and smoky eye. And, a brown and gold smoky eye, and that's not what I wanted for this look. Um, now I'm taking a little bit of Half Baked and putting that onto my finger and just taking that onto my lids. I know I said I didn't want it to be a brown and gold smoky eye, and it's not. It's a gold and green and um, and taking that underneath my lower lash line and just a whole bunch of different colors, and I think that's re what really makes me fall in love with this look. Haha, <laughs> fall, get it? It's fall, and I fell in love with it. And now I'm taking Virgin and just highlighting my brow bone and inner corner. I mean, nothing special here. Okay, so now I'm taking this, like, really gorgeous ambery copper color and taking that and working that into my outer V to give my eye a bit more definition and a bit more shape. Um, this reminds me of one of the colors from the Lorac Pro Palette, which I've been thinking about getting. But, and then I'm just blending that in with a crease brush. So I just think this color really makes the whole look just a look a bit more smoky and a bit more intense, which is what I really love about fall looks is because they're very smoky, but they're not glittery like a holiday look. And then taking the same shadow underneath my lower lash line. And now I'm taking a NYX lip liner in deep purple. And as long as it's not in my waterline, it is okay to put by my eyes. And what to makeup tutorial would not be complete without a snack break. And now I'm taking Maybelline Baby Lips in Grapevine and just putting that on my lips to give my lips kind of a plum look to it. Ignore my dogs in the background. And you could use this as blush just if you wanted to, but you don't have to. And I'm taking a little bit of face powder and just touching up my foundation. Um, this is Revlon Colorstay face powder. I'm just trying to use it up, but um, I'm just touching up my face because I looked a bit shiny and curling my lashes. Just applying a bit of Maybelline's Rocket Mascara to give my lashes some volume. So this is the finished look. I have a couple of zits, ignore those, but um, I love you guys and I'll see you guys later. Bye.